Hello everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to access into access denied. So first of all, you gotta install these three applications for since you know you want to like enter here. I mean, you can see I'm entered here, but I don't know why it's working. But when you click inside here, it's like saying access denied, right? Like here access denied. Okay, in order to fix that, we gotta go to it inside the shizuko so shizuko must be like on android 11 or up you can enable wireless debugging you can see this so your android must be like over 11 or 11 so yes so let's start as a first we gotta go to pairing now in order to go pairing you need to connect wi-fi it could be any wi-fi Okay, I'm going to connect this one. After connecting your Wi-Fi, go to settings and scroll down and click on about phone and click on software information and you can find this build number and you can click on it until it's going to say developer mode has already been turned it on. After that, you got to go back and click on developer options right here and you gotta scroll down until you find wireless debugging and enable this and click on it here and you can see this two options right so you gotta click on here so once you click on here you'll see this code so this code is going to need it you when it says like pairing service found so you got to enter this code into this you know service found text and you just 59 and once you've done that you just got to click send you can see this pairing successful now i can start shizuko application let's go back and we got to click on shizuko now we gotta go back and you gotta just click on start but it's not working it seems like so let's try again it seems like our attempt okay guys if this is not working you you, you have to try again all right so Okay, now you can see this. This is started automatically. And yes, this should be saying Shizuku is running. And now we gotta open the archiver. We gotta open data. And you can see this file app. So when this happens, you just gotta go back and click on authorize zero applications. And you need to enable the archiver. Once you enable that, go back inside here and go to settings, go to root. So you, you need to choose this, all right? You need to choose this one. And you can enable it. And it, it shows your, you know, data and OP. OB things like you can see this there are a lot of things if this is not working you can use files all right if this is not working you can just use files this is helpful because this allows you to see your all applications so yes if you can't i mean if the shizuka is not working you can just use this files you can download from play store so yes, thank you for watching guys.